very good. And you won you won a prize for um, providing solutions for problems here for children in Seattle. Maybe you can briefly tell us about this. The main problem is most of them do not even have access to the internet and for those that actually do, you see that the due to the high data rates in the country, it's very, very expensive. So with help from the mentorship that we got from UNICEF, the training from the Generation Unlimited Bootcamp, and mentors, and mentors from the Directorate of Science, Technology and Innovation, we developed the Easy STEM server. Um, so we have this server, where you can update content like Easy Planning, Passport, Upship, Quality Open Source STEM content, in which the schools in the remote areas can still have access to it. So in this hotspot, you just put your Wi-Fi on, on your phone or laptop, and then you see Easy STEM server, and then click to connect to it. And then you also have to go to the web domain, which is easystem.snowpad, and then you can start using it. No, wonderful. And and I understand the island is somewhere over there, right? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Let me see. Yeah. I'll join you for that. I want to really see how this works, how this your technology, your ideas are helping the children. Yes. So congratulations again. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>a lot of problems. Then besides, it also enables children to learn about the world in which they live. So we see that young people usually try to use the internet to study, but the main problem is they do not have access to it, and even those that do actually find it very difficult and very expensive due to the high data rates in the country. So that was what we saw, and we came up with the Easy STEM server, which provides offline access to STEM educational materials for students, even in the most remote villages offline. Since you have the Easy STEM server and you have a device, you can easily access the best the materials from all around the world in your fingertips and all of this is offline and it is totally free. Project Giga is a bold initiative by the government of Sierra Leone, supported by UNICEF and ITU, to connect all 12,000 schools to the internet. Although Sierra Leone's infrastructure is growing, this will definitely take some time. What Team Lorem has done is to develop a solution that provides children with the access to a localized digital environment. And this solution will help prevent more young people from falling into the digital divide. And what's more interesting about this solution is that it's developed by Sierra Leoneans for Sierra Leoneans in Sierra Leone, but it can be used anywhere.